Hey everyone, welcome back. Have you ever met a situation that your Samsung phone is stuck on the logo somehow? It happens a lot on my Samsung phone, it's pretty annoying. But don't worry, I will show you 5 ways to fix this issue, let's go. Method 1. Fix Samsung stuck on logo with reiboot for Android. This is an Android system repair tool. It can fix more than 50 Android system issues, including a Samsung phone stuck on logo. Strongly recommend you try this first. Check the download link in the description if you are interested. Once installed, connect your Samsung to your PC and open reiboot. Click the Repair Android System option. Click Repair Now. Choose your phone brand, series, models, your country and carrier, and then click Next. Reiboot will begin to download the firmware that is needed. Once the download is done, click Repair Now. Now you need to follow the guide to put your Samsung phone into download mode so that Reiboot can fix your phone. Press the volume down and power buttons to force turn off the stuck phone. Once power off press the volume up and volume down buttons at the same time. Keep pressing till the warning page shows up and choose to get in the download page or your Samsung maybe will get to the download page directly. Then Reiboot will begin to fix your Samsung phone stuck on logo issue. It will take a while. Be patient. It will be done very soon. Then you can see, my Samsung is back to its normal state. I can access it without any problem, and all my data is still there. Go try it. If you would like to try something that doesn't need a PC, you can try the following methods. Method 2. Force Restart. When there is a bug happens on your phone, the first thing you should try is Force Restart. So press and hold the volume down and the power button. Keep holding till the logo appears. If everything goes right, your Samsung phone should be normal again. If it doesn't, then you should try method 1 or the following methods. Method 3. Boot your Samsung into safe mode. Press and hold the volume down button and the power button. Keep pressing till the black screen appears and then release the power button. Press and hold the volume down button till you enter home page. Then you will see a safe mode on the left side. Now you might need to delete some software that might cause your Samsung stuck on the logo. For example, some unsecured apps, third-party apps, or other things that you download from unsecured platforms. I will randomly delete something here, because I don't have an unsecured app. Then just press the volume down and the power button to force restart your phone to exit safe mode. Keep holding till the Samsung logo appears. If this method still cannot fix the issue, then it might be the cache file causing the issue. Follow the next method. Method 4. Wipe cache partition. To wipe the cache partition, you need to put your Samsung in recovery mode. Press and hold the volume down and the power button Keep holding till the screen is black. Then press and hold the volume up and power button. Keep holding till the Samsung logo appears. Then you should get in the recovery mode. Press the volume down button to choose wipe cache partition option. Choose yes and press power button to confirm. Wait for the process over. Then choose reboot system now. See if the stuck on logo issue is disappear or not. If this still cannot fix the issue, then all you can do is factory reset your Samsung phone. Hope you got backup. Method 5. Factory Reset. To factory reset your Samsung, still need to get in the recovery mode first. Press and hold the volume down. In the power button, keep holding till the screen is black. Then press and hold the volume up at power button. Keep holding till the Samsung logo appears. And you should get in the recovery mode. Choose Wipe Data and Factory Reset option. And choose Factory Data Reset. When the process is done, choose Reboot System now. If everything goes right, by the process over, your Samsung should be okay again. You will need to set it up. I will skip them here. Then you can see, my Samsung phone is back to its normal state again, but you aware of this. You will lose all your data, so if you don't want to lose data, you better use other methods. 
Okay, that's it. Hope this video is helpful to you. I will be grateful if you subscribe. See you guys next time.